Sonic State here at Superbooth 2019 with Michaela from hey. Mind Music Labs. Now, we made a video, you may have seen it already, uh, about Retrolog uh, running inside a standalone kind of box. Now, the thing is, the underlying technology is really interesting, so it warranted a little further investigation. And so with Michaela, he's going to show some other applications of, uh, of Elk running in different uh, Mind um, boxes, I guess. Um, I suppose if we start with some Eurorack would, would, would make sense. Yes. So what we got here? So, I mean, here we have a, um, a, product, a project that we did with Propellerhead that is a Eurorack that runs a run ex, run ex, extension, mm. and actually the plugin that is running is Korg Polysix. Yeah. And, uh, so, here. Yeah. Yeah. Then you just can bring it in the way you want. But the, the cool thing is that it's exactly the same plugin that is running on a computer. Yeah, sounds great. I mean, it is a brilliant center yeah. policy. Yeah. So, but I mean, this is interesting though. We're, we're, we're seeing, I mean, here, obviously, in the Eurorack module, but the fact is, Korg didn't port this across, did no, they? No, no. I mean, Korg is happy that we are, we are showcasing this, but basically, it's exactly the same Rack extension that's running on the computer. Okay. So, cool. and the, the, I mean, the cool thing about Elk, Elk is a music operating system that allows a VSD and a Rack extension to run on hardware on a general purpose CPU. That could be Intel or could be ARM based. So let's have a look at some of the other things. You can uh, here we have a highs. And it's uh, basically, uh, this is one of our development board. It's actually uh, Intel based, and we have a drum machine. So everything, all the processing is done by the box, and it's uh, you know running in real time, and we can run the system below one millisecond latency. Yeah, that's amazing. So there's a whole bunch of extra things yeah, here, again, again, showing how you can use these sort of embedded yeah, I think systems. another interesting one is that, you know, here we have a audio modeling mm, plugin. Really good. Uh, it's actually a saxophone. And look, I mean, it's... It's, well, it's exactly the same plugin that's running on the computer. Yeah. And the magic for the user is actually, you know, going into the mode where they just do the sound design. Then, if they have access to it from a computer, they save their preset, they can open, turn on the device, sync with the cloud, and get exactly the same preset. So in that way, they actually have a different kind of approach of what they are composing. And also the other way around, they can do their magic on the device, and then save it in the cloud. And when they do you know, editing and composing on the computer, they can just work on the computer. But it's exactly the same plugin. Amazing. So, I mean, like with, with an enclosure like this, this is like a custom enclosure, I guess. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, uh, you, uh, well, Mind Music Labs um, w wouldn't sell something like this, or would would that be possible? Cause, so, what? Because this looks really good. <laughs> so, what we're doing now, we launched Elk, you know, in January last year, and what we're doing now, we are partnering with a, a hardware company who will build the hardware. So, our product is Elk Music Operating System, so it's the platform that allows, you know, both developers, uh, Rack Extension or VSC developer, to go in the hardware market or hardware company choose the best, I mean, we have so much of great stuff out there that runs on the computer. So we are basically, we go exactly in between where you can get all the magic that you can do on the computer and bring it on the hardware. Yeah. And so then this is interesting, the one here. Yeah, this is, uh, uh, I mean, this basically we can run any synth inside. It's kind of a, um, and. We can ask uh, one of our guys to do the demo if you want. Uh, and uh, yeah, here again, the idea is that when a musician get the device, can use it as an analog device. Then when they need to do more stuff, they just share the preset on the computer and do their stuff and, and the other way around. But also, I mean, the sharing preset is only one thing. But think about, oh, well, now there is a new plugin uh, out there that I'm using on my DAW. I want to get in on my hardware. Well, you just install it. I mean, and, and what we are creating is uh, a plugin store for hardware that will be launched soon where basically 
uh, you know, people can buy on a Power by L hardware. They can uh, buy new plugins and also share the presets. Nice. And then, uh, is there any way to sync what's going on on your computer to your hardware? Then. Yeah, of course. I mean, we we in Elk World, which is the 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 that we, we will release soon. It's called Elk World. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And and, uh, the, and, and, and they'll be able to buy. You'll be able to buy plugins from Elk World. Yeah, powered so, by Elk, certified yeah. powered by Elk uh, plugin. Okay. And then I mean, in there there will be a cloud base where people can save the, the presets and they have access both from uh, the the device or the computer. Amazing. So so, so you, yeah. you have one account and then for the user it's just like. You know what? What do we all do with our Google Doc, basically? <laughs> right. So what you do here is immediately represented there using the cloud as a, a means for it to or, yeah. and, and automatically syncing. Yeah, I mean, if yeah, you want we, it, we could, if yeah. you want it to. Yeah. Uh, okay. So um, when will Elk World be? You say that that's coming soon. So the first product, powered by Elk product, is a, a DivoMark uh, Smart Multiam that has been showcased in NAM and uh, is will be in the market soon, uh, matter of months. And together with that release, there will be also the elk.world. Mm. So we are really excited. Yeah, this, yeah. Is, this is kind of where we should be at at 2019, really, with this synchronizing between platforms. It makes a lot of sense. So uh, yeah, we're very interested to see this development. Thank you very much for showing us this. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs>